A computer desk overlooking Irvine shows a snapshot of the future of firefighting. A local teenager has been working on an early fire detection system using AI since he was in the fifth grade. Incredible. He tells mm -hmm. her, Michelle Geely, the point of the system is to think small before the fires grow too mm -hmm. big. I'm actually very excited because this is our very first deployment. It's a dream come true for Newport Beach teenager Ryan Honoree, who's created an AI driven early wildfire detection system designed to alert firefighters before the flames are spotted by humans. And the whole idea of my platform is to be able to detect the fire when it's when it is or smaller than one foot by one foot. So the idea is that by the time the firefighters are there to put it out, a human shouldn't have even been able to see it from their house or things like that. So right here we have the solar panel with this box that has all of the electronics and the batteries in it. Up here we have the infrared camera with the gas that smoke sensor right below it. The 17 year old put his technology to work in Irvine's Quail Hill open space, not far from the flashpoint of the destructive 1993 Laguna Beach fire. It's an invention he's worked on since fifth grade. And I was watching the devastating fires that were killing many people and destroying their homes, and I thought that. So it would take a picture of that fire. It would detect it from its infrared and maybe even its smoke as well. And then it would instantly send that um, information and uh, as an email, text, or um, push notification to for example, it might be directed toward the Orange County Fire Authority's phones. Andre partnered with the Irvine Ranch Conservancy, which provided $250,000 in funding. Orange County Fire Authority Chief Brian Fennessy is a mentor who says we are proud and grateful that his technology has the potential to provide our firefighters with real time data that expedites resource allocation, improves firefighting strategy and enhances our mission to protect life and property. The next group of detectors will be deployed along the 133 freeway going into Laguna Beach over the next few months. The goal is to have about 25 of them installed by the end of the year. In Irvine, Michelle Geely, KCAL News.